but the more they looked, the more they found there was no pattern. Not on Ruiz or on any other volcano. For all their hopes, the A-types had proved to be a dead end. Every volcano created its own pattern, and, and it was almost impossible to come up with a, with a, a chart saying that this, this is the book that we're going to go by. Seismology had fallen short. It would take the arrival of a different kind of scientist to deliver volcanology out of its confusion. He trained as an engineer, then as a physicist, then as a rocket scientist. But for five years, Bernard Chouet had locked himself in his office, attempting to solve what the rest of science said was impossible. Understanding when a volcano will erupt. I realized that volcanoes were, although they had been looked at for a long, long time and people had always been fascinated by them, they were relatively poorly understood. And so this was a frontier that was worth uh, exploring. When Shue arrived in Colombia, he too went straight to the seismographs. He saw how, before the eruption, the scientists had plotted the A-types, desperately searching for a pattern. They had paper records at the time. I noticed that they had, of course, a lot of A-type earthquakes, and they were all identified with a little uh, sticker. But something else had caught his eye. Tucked in amongst the A-types was another signal. Scientists knew about it. They'd even given it a name, the B-type. But no one knew what it meant. It was sort of a mystical sort of thing. We didn't really understand fully what it was, nor did we understand that we could use it. The B-types were a conundrum. Unlike the A-types, they had no clear beginning and they tailed away slowly. Often, they would merge with other signals, making them hard to see at all. It was really difficult to separate them and say definitively, well, it was this type of event that would be helpful for forecasting. They were too messy. But Shue could see something in them that no one else could see. It stared you in the face. Wow, this is, this is obviously different. Embedded in a, in a record among all these A-type earthquakes were classic-looking, quasi-monochromatic harmonic signature. Beautiful textbook example. Or as he would put it more simply, a long period event. <laughs> 